Jerry Azuma, former Chicago Bear, played seven years, all pro, defensive back. Right now we're gonna talk about hand placement, and that's gonna be the tip for today. So, I have my wide receiver right here, and I have my defensive back. Hand placement is very important because when you're at a jam position with the wide receiver, you wanna make sure that you have the proper hand placement. So we're gonna demonstrate that right now. So this is our wide receiver. This is the line of scrimmage right here, and here's the DB. Now the DB is in a great stance. We talked about that a little bit earlier. So now it's all about hand placement. If he places his hands too low at the line of scrimmage, a wide receiver can basically knock that off. If he places it too high, a wide receiver can basically swim that and knock him off. He wants to make sure that he, he shoots his hands right at his chest plate and, and locks that elbow because that's gonna be very important because if that wide receiver tries to move, he's He's stuck, there's nowhere to go. And plus, if he tries to come down, he has a tough base right there because that elbow is locked. And that's the proper way that you wanna do it right there with the other arm. He wants to shoot that arm and make sure that it's right at the chest plate. He doesn't wanna have it in the middle or on the other side because it's easy for the wide receiver to knock that down. He wants to shoot it up and jam him right here, right underneath the, the, the chest and right underneath the shoulder, and that's the proper way to do it right there. And I'm Jerry Azuma, and that's your pro tip for today.